Rodriguez, SpaceX. SpaceX counting down for two critical missions. The company tapped to bring astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams back down to Earth in February. Hello, everybody. The duo has made the International Space Station home nearly three months right. after launching on Boeing Starliner. That spaceship now set to return home without them because of thruster issues that left the two stranded. Boeing saying in part, we continue to focus first and foremost on the safety of the crew and spacecraft. And in just days. It's been a really exciting journey. The Polaris Dawn mission set to make history will include the first all civilian spacewalk and a whopping orbit 870 miles above Earth. Welcome to our simulator. Together, Scott Petit, Sarah Gillis and Anna Menon, led by Jared Isaacman, will do what no human has before. Previewed in this animation, across five days, they'll do Starlink comms tests. Astronauts Gillis and Isaacman will step out of the Dragon capsule and test human bounds in space. Up above us is where we'll actually go out into the vacuum of space. The risks in space are something former shuttle commander Eileen Collins knows all too well. I think it's going to be fine, but I also think that it's risky. But for crew leader Isaacman, the risk is worth the reward. We're trying to inspire people to think about this extraordinary world we could live in tomorrow. One step and 870 miles closer to expanding home beyond Earth. Marissa Parra, NBC News. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.